Hi guys, welcome to another video. How's it going? So, I have thought of making a start training time since... It's just been a long time, okay? So today we're training our horses, or one of them. I thought of Minty, because she's kind of cute. It's a she, and she is slaying. So I thought, let's reward her and train her. Also, look at this super cute outfit I found out. Isn't that just a big sleigh? I just need a cute saddlebag with a cute pet. Because pets are literally everything. <gasps> Let's take Tabby with us. She's cute, guys. She's cute. Okay. Okay. Um, how so oh, does horses really sad? Um, do I want to train like that? No, I don't. Ugh, I hate slow horses. I hate it. I hate it. hate it. Okay, never mind. We really need free horse care week or happy horse week or whatever this was. Um... Because all my horses are literally, they are so depressed. And I'm also, I don't really change that, you know. S stable care is just really expensive. Then we have a vet somewhere, because I might need help. <laughs> yeah, I know it's me again, but oh my gosh. I just bought 10,000 star coins. They're all gone. What should I do? I don't even have happy horse treats anymore. Should we just go for it? No, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> oh no, what have I done? Never mind, why did I do that? I'm honest, I'm really excited to train because I haven't done it in a while. <coughs> <coughs> you know, <laughs> I thought drinking iced tea would solve my crusty throat problems, but it almost killed me. Never mind. So, um... Let us start. I think I like your toes. Um, okay, so, well, thanks, I guess. Must mean that they're very, very slay. Okay, cute, very cute, cute. I think I like your toes as well. Let's both like each other's toes. But I do not have a foot fetish, so I can't really, you know, it's a life I say I like your toes, but I guess. But I guess, great, I'm, I feel honored. I'm glad you like my toes, I'm glad you don't hate them. This girl is giving 2016 and I'm here for it. All right, next one says, I want a princess dress so I can get married, but fancy. Oh, that's not a bad idea, actually. Princess dresses are so cute. Last Christmas, last Winter Village, they had like this, oh, hashtag, we're never gonna bring those clothes back. So if you want them, buy them now. And there were dresses in there, a yellow one and a blue one and some others. And oh my gosh, they were so cute. They were giving Barbie. And I really just had to buy them because they were really adorable. And um, they kind of look like princess dresses. So the game is full of dresses. You just need to find the right ones. Usually the older ones have like a lot of cute details and aren't just boring recolored ones. Yes, they're recolored, but not boring. They have cute details on them and stuff. So just go to global store, go to tops and just scroll all the way down because that's where the old stuff is at. So yeah, they're really cute. That's what I recommend. Once I had a nightmare about Courtney. She unalived my cat. Oh my gosh, um, that's rough. Okay, she unalived my cat, so I wrote Star Stable. If they could remove her from the game. Next day, I found out there was two more of her in game. So I told Star Stable, if they don't remove them, I will hack them. They never applied. Well, that's understandable, because... I mean, you can't you can't really hack Star Stable. I mean, you can, you can totally hack your own account and, you know, scrabble devil around in the... Game files of your account, but that's not gonna hack Star Stable as a company. So they probably just thought, well, cute, we don't give a flip. And then I kind of moved on with life. Have I ever dreamed about a Star Stable character? I don't think I have. Okay, guys, let's level up. I think I once had a.
dream about Steve, but that's that's the only case. Well, that's cute. I hope your cat is well, though. Okay, next one says, oh, why is my horse ugly? Oh, wait, it's yours. <laughs> so funny. Oh my gosh, I literally had to laugh. Oh, it keeps going. That's what someone said to me yesterday. Oh my gosh, it wasn't even an insult to me. Oh, that is a little bit sad. <laughs> that's don't take it personal okay they okay but it's really funny <laughs> that's probably something i would say to one of my friends no need to be sad about that they don't they don't care okay it's all right next one says i told my mom i hate playing online games meanwhile i play star stable well don't lie to your parents they usually find out everything so you can be just i mean well you know <laughs> If she told you you're not allowed, then it's a critical situation. Then you should maybe stop playing and then ask her if you can. But if you just told her you don't like games, I don't get the point. What, like, why lie to your mom? She won't kill you. Oh, next one says, I hate my club. To leave, I don't get the point. People are like, oh my gosh, I hate my whole entire club, but I don't tell them. And... I I don't know why I'm staying, no matter what. Like, why do you stay? Just leave. I don't get it. Just, girl. Also, it's an online game. Oh my gosh. Literally do what you want. I mean, if you want to stay in a club that you hate, feel free. But I feel like that's kind of like a waste. I want to get the big bonnie bonus, guys. Because I have enough trash. Oh, no, 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 no. I want... That's why I left Steve. No one, like, okay, never mind. You know what? Do what you want. Next one says, I like to eat poop from other horses. That's not really hygienic. You know, I would advise you to not do that because it's kind of gross. Overall, bad for your horse. Also kind of wrecks your reputation, you know? Yeah, but it's cute. It's really aesthetic. I hope you at least... You know, wipe your horse's mouth after it eats it. Um, I have two boyfriends and one husband. Um, why is that not illegal? That's my first question. And second question is, how do you do it? I mean, what if they meet up? Like, they don't know each other. Like, a random RRP. And then they're like, well, I have a girlfriend, guys. And then the other person's like, okay, but wait, she's my wifey. And then... There's gonna be the third person like, well, no, she's my girlfriend, not your wife, not your girlfriend either. And then they're gonna find out and you will have zero partners in the end, you know? I don't really know what to say. If you ask me, that's feral and I don't really know <laughs> why you would do that. I mean, I'm married. I am married, actually. Can't have me anymore. I'm not in the market. Um, I'm married to be... <laughs> because she acted like she was a dude and then we kind of got married when we were 12 and we kind of never played again since then <laughs> next one says when i buy horses i write a review to start stable about the horse it's usually a rant <laughs> valid next <laughs> so valid it's so acceptable i i can't i mean yeah like why not actually we should all do that and then be like, well, this horse is trash. This horse is ugly. I hate this horse. I wish I didn't buy this horse. Give me my star coins back. <laughs> Something like that. So, you know, whatever they did was horrible. In my opinion, that's a really good idea. You know? Next one says, I waste my star coins when I get 100 star coins from my allowance. I'm not proud of doing it. Okay, but it's valid because I today is Sunday where I'm filming. That means yesterday I had my 100 star coins allowance and I just spent it on Minty's health bar. So I get it. I get it. Get it. It's fine. That's totally okay. You know, you get your star coins and you have free choice of whatever you want to do with it. So a boom and a different outfit. It's giving actually training my horse. Guys, by the way, I have a question. I have a question. What would you say if I made a Star Stable realistic roleplay series on my channel? I kind of fell in love with 
watching Star Stable realistic roleplay videos and I was like, wait, I kind of want to do it too, you know? So what do you think? I even have like everything planned out and I have a bunch of accounts to screw around with because I have my two besties accounts, then I have my account, I have Jessica. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? But what I yet don't know is which stable I would choose to, you know, live. Also, I'm not- I don't ride horses in real life, so I wouldn't- I don't know if I would include the realistic part. I would try my best, of course, but I don't know if I would be good enough to call it realistic. Next one says, once I got hit on by a player- oh my gosh, sorry, Minty. So, I reported them and told them- oh my gosh. So, I reported them and told them they have a bug on their head. I think I would do that too. It's a good defense mechanism. Because I'm personally really scared of bugs. And if someone tells me I have a bug on my head, I literally freak out. And I don't know why this is happening. But I get a lot of bug videos on my like Instagram feed. <laughs> and I had like three heart attacks in the past few four days. Because once there was this huge spider walking, running down the stairs. And I, li I, I literally froze. It's a valid move. Next one says, I've sold at least 20k star coins worth of horses. Oh my gosh, I would be sad about that too. Why? Well, maybe she's just like me and she has decision making problems. Because I have to do a lot. Well, dang it. <laughs> you know? Yes, I had my selling moment, but I really regret it and I will never, probably never, ever. Oh my gosh! I don't even have to sell my horses, I kill them all. You know, I had my selling moment, but I totally regret it. And I will never ever, probably never ever sell any horse again. Because it's kind of crucial, you know? Okay, next one's a long one. It says, okay, so me and my sister used to share a Star Stable online account. And one time I was on looking at all our horses and she had one of the Nixie's, Nixie horses that she never rode. And I hate it, it, so I sold it. So I sold it. I didn't really think about it and thought she wouldn't she wouldn't care, but I was wrong. Oh no. She was pissed at me and I I had to buy her another one. So yeah, thumbs up. Cute, that's really cute. That's unfortunate, you know. But I mean, okay, it's valid though, the Nixies. Oh, I would not be my first, you know, choice when I would buy. A magical horse because they're kind of crusty and a little bit you know my advice would be don't necessarily sell horses that you share with someone else but you know you can never know what they like and what they don't so no oh my gosh i think sharing an account with someone else that would literally stress me out so much like what if the other person spends the star coins on something i think is like a really ugly like what do you do then like because you kind of share it you know like you can't say well we're gonna sell it and you have to buy star coins you know but hey cute that you bought another one for her cute cute <laughs> really cute i mean okay you don't really had another choice but you know in all my friends minds i'm a huge horse trainer secretly though i buy all the levels <laughs> I mean, I understand why someone wouldn't want to train their horse because it is really repetitive and kind of boring. Honestly, just listen to music or watch a YouTube video about something that you find interesting if you want to train your horse. But I get buying levels, just it's really expensive. <laughs> In this stable financial state, I don't get where you take all these star coins from because it's really expensive, you know? Like I personally, I could never... It, it, the star coins are just too precious to me. But I mean, I guess you have a good rap. Slay. So that was it, guys. Thanks for participating. It was really fun. <gasps> by the way, by the way, we hit 300 subscribers, like, in a minute. That's crazy. I think when I hit 500, I'll make, like, a, a giveaway. Star coin giveaway code, whatever. If you guys think that's fun, <laughs> let me know if you want that. 
um i hope you guys had fun i wish you a good sunday i love you all so much yeah have a good one guys see you next time bye Thank you.